one thing I just want to say, which is, won't be very long, just a quick video, is I can't help but see how much everything is falling apart for the cabal. And I really mean that. Um, there's even with the, the um, post of the post a while, uh, a few weeks ago about cymatics. And cymatics shown that when one uh, frequency, the sand on a plate creates a geometric, geometric pattern. And then in between one pattern and then a higher frequency, which creates a new one, there's a chaos period. And uh, basically, I believe that we're moving into a new frequency, a new vibration, which is a truth frequency okay and the lies are being shown for what they are and um, but what I've noticed is in cymatics is even after the geometric geometric pattern uh, is fully in its vibrational geometric geometric pattern it's fully ma made it okay it's come out of the chaos period and it's it's now formed the shape the sand there's still uh, a number of grains of sand that are not in formation okay they still uh, and I don't know whether that means that some just are not gonna make it it's just that simple and that's obviously gonna be the case that's the same with infection in the body when you heal the body uh, some some cells don't make it okay but there's also a spiritual element to everything as you know there's a spiritual uh, I'm understanding more that every being's got their spiritual path, whether they're meant to make it or not. It can be heartbreaking when it's our family and we know there's a lot of people that are, that are, that are suffering and not going to make it. I get that. But uh, I'm just talking about every area, okay? Every single area of their lives is being exposed, big time. Every area is falling. Uh, apart even what six months ago people were saying was way out there people are now uh, becoming open to and just some of the things that I've shared over the past 18 months I've just I, I can't explain it I can't even put my finger on it but it's making me so happy people are so getting on the lies and they're open to some of the biggest uh, conspiracies and, and truth bombs. And I'm seeing it everywhere. I'm seeing it in groups um, that I didn't think I'd ever see it from people I never thought I'd see it from. And it's so enlightening to just, it's so, it's so, uh, it makes me happy to see how people are coming good. These truth vibrations, this new era that we're coming in is exposing the lies, but it's also truth resonates on many different layers it's actually creating responsibility and it's as, it's as simple as that tell the truth be the truth act the truth see the truth um, and take responsibility there's no more pointing fingers pointing fingers just doesn't work anymore it is as simple as that taking responsibility for where we are who we are what we are um, that's the that's the way the world's moving so many people I know who are buying land so many people are getting land getting the land they've always spoke of so many people so many people I know are growing in their own gardens um, so many people are just seeing that this is not genuine they're seeing that that that's in their immediate world on their phones they might see a horror story but in the actual day-to-day -day life they're just not seeing this COVID nonsense and they're, they're just seeing a police presence. A lot of police are coming forward. Um, I think the message today is aligned with truth. And even if it looks like things are getting bad, just keep doing what's right. Keep being truthful. Uh, keep being open. Keep opening yourself up to, to, to know that maybe you're gonna find truths that are gonna shed more truth to truths you already thought you knew. Uh, so be open to everything. Keep smiling, stay in love, love your neighbor. It's a great time to be connected to the soul world right now. 
um, your guides and open your heart and there there's so many changes on every single front from uh, just everything everything is changing and that's that's the world I'm really seeing it's very important that we hold the focus of the world we want to move into as well we have to let the old world go and if people are clinging to it you're not gonna stop I've tried it trust me you're not going to help someone let go of the old world by telling them what to do okay uh, I think it was Chuang Tzu, it was Chuang Tzu from the Taoist tradition, he said it's, it's way more effective to go in one inch than try and preach outward uh, ten feet. Meaning that just live your example, okay? Just be what you want to be, what you want to see in the world, and then what will happen is, as more people see you, your, exp your example is more powerful than what you say and they'll come to you and then you're just asking as answering questions then it's far more powerful than trying to tell someone what to do people want to get the vaccine let them get the vaccine it's totally fine don't judge them for it if someone wants to wear a mask let them wear a mask they want to wear a mask in the car on their own let them do it they're clinging to the old world they're living in fear and they um, it's just as simple as that if you go over and say mate take your mask off they're gonna think you're the mad one so we um, just smile at them just say i've got no as if to say i've got no mask on i'm happy and i love you it's all good but we're seeing the divide the divide is going to get more and more divisive um before it falls apart and then the new world will come and it, this could take years this could take a few more weeks or months we don't know but uh, just keep focusing and holding the vision of what you want the world you want because these uh, universal environments that are created are also so fertile ground for manifestation. So manifest what you want. Um, and that's why they're using them, so pushing them so hard to try and make people create uh, the world they want. But it's fallen apart so much. So uh, yeah, I, I'm very happy. And I just wanted to share that. You take care, love you all.